Hey friends, uh, so good to be here today. Um, I'm really grateful to be able to be here with you today. I had an accident at the rink last night, so I am in so much pain to walk right now. Um, but I just got off of my AA meeting about a half hour ago, and I kind of wanted to talk about uh, the topic at hand, which was um, self-pity and, you know, woe is me type of thing. And I think that this stems out further than uh, alcoholism and addiction as a whole. I think that we all have an amount of gratification that we want to reach in each self, in each self and it becomes almost like an obsession itself, almost like an addiction itself, just to please oneself, to have that self-gratification. And... I was explaining how I went from being four months sober last year and so proud of myself for doing so to having a glass of wine here and there, you know, throughout the day. And um, this past Thanksgiving, really just taking it all to a horrible halt for my family, for myself. And, um, I have a lot of making up to do, you know, but I wanted to talk on mainly the woe is me part because I don't do that. Um, instead, I fuel it into I've got to do better. So I don't sit there and go, oh, you know, I can't do this. I can't do that. I can't blah, blah, blah. I go, no, you're going to do this and you're going to do it correctly and you know almost like a perfectionist type of way and I have OCD really bad too so it just feels the fire and with my ADHD brain it does not work that way it never does um and so today I really want you to focus on building a support group if you don't have one and being supportive likewise for others so that you can build that support group and y'all can support one another. I've sat here for so long going, how am I going, how am I going to explain this? How am I going to fix this? How am I going to do this for years? And, you know, joining AA was definitely a prize winning moment for me because I knew that I was going to get help choosing to leave because I didn't think that I had actual alcoholism, I just had a self-control problem, was me trying to gratify my own needs. And the more that I study the Bible, the more that I study the, the AA book, the 12 steps and all of it, I realize more and more that I am so much more out of control of things than I thought I was. And that's a hard pill to swallow for somebody that likes to be in control of things, you know, not in a mannerism of don't talk to this person, but in a manner of I just like to have a schedule. I just like to have a routine. I like to know what's going on. I don't like being surprised in that type of way where something just pops up. I'll handle it, but I don't like it. So today really just focus on support and remember what you sow is what you reap so if you're not giving out support you're not going to get the report that you need and be honest about it be honest about your struggles be honest about what's bothering you what you've turned into your own obsessions or addictions and start making those changes to better yourself but that is all I have for you today, guys. I am going to relax today before I have to work tomorrow because it really hurts to walk. I fell directly on my tailbone and it sucks. But I love you guys so very much. Thank you for your undying support and thank you for your undying love that you send me every, every, every day. I was going to say each and every day, but apparently every three times was good. But I love y'all. As always, stay happy, stay healthy, stay safe, and we'll talk later.